Welcome everybody to Cloud Innovators Live for Telecommunications. We're here at Digital Transformation World in Copenhagen and I have with me Arthur from Google Cloud. Arthur, can you introduce yourself? Hello Brian, thank you. It's a pleasure to be here with you. So I'm a solution consultant for Google. I work in the telecom global industry and uh, I ran uh, a Catalyst this year. Oh beautiful, what was one of the catalysts that you were running? So it's called a Gen AI, Hyper Personalized Customer Experience. That's the title. And we assembled a team of five CSPs, British Telecom, Deutsche Telekom, Telecom Italia, Turknet, and Bell Canada, together with Accenture and Pega Systems. And we built an amazing platform for hyper personalized customer experience. Well, well that's certainly a hot area, and that is a powerhouse group of communication service providers. What was the problem statement you guys were trying to solve? So the problem statement is the CSPs, they have a very hard time now to get new revenue in, right? So they are stagnating. The traditional marketing is not very efficient. They keep sending the same messages to all subscribers, right? So they kind of teach subscribers to ignore them. And consumer behavior is changing quite a lot nowadays. People expect personalized experiences. They need to be, you know, talk to the heart. And this is the problem that uh, we are trying to solve. Or actually, we have solved it. Well, that's a hugely interesting problem. I mean, I expect personalized services as a consumer anywhere and as a business too. It's important for CSPs to understand their customers. So it sounds like you were really getting after that. Can you tell me a little bit about that project and how you guys came up with the solution. What was that solution? Yeah, so obviously we had to talk to all the CSPs to understand the problem from their perspective, right? And one common outcome was churn. So we built a use case around churn prediction and we assembled a platform on top of Google Cloud. So we collect a lot of data sources. We use a complex event processing taking not only the customer information that we have, but also event, network events, right? And combining those together, we are able to do a real-time yes. prediction based on that customer experience, customer behavior. And we reach out to Vertex AI to score, right? So we have a machine learning model, a predictive AI is the first uh, segment of the pipeline. Once we score it, we give it up to Pega, and Pega is a decisioning brain. It has the full CSP context inside it, and it's able to provide the next best action or next best offer, depending on the situation. For the last mile of the communication, we use generative AI to create these hyper-personalized messages, right, tailored to that customer. And all this happens in real time, below 200 milliseconds, and it's not just one interaction at a time, we can do millions of interactions at a time, right? So that's what Google Cloud provides, the scale of, of this amazing. <laughs> Very amazing, so it's scale, it's the ability to ingest not only CX and customer data, but network data, that's, that's, those are new elements. Yes. So if I'm drumming long and I'm always dropping in a certain location or I'm having a bad, there's an outage, you can more proactively analyze that data at scale. Correct. That's hard to beat, that's hard to beat. What were some of the results that you were seeing and how would you help CSPs to assess that value? So the team put together an ROI calculator which takes as a baseline a Forrester study and this was a very thorough study and we enhanced it with our capabilities that we developed in this catalyst, right? And that calculator is actually a contribution back to TM Forum as an asset, so anybody will be able to use it to check how we built it, right? So correctness of the model, and then the results that come out of it. So we simulated an ROI for three years of 615%. That means that in the first seven months, you already paid back your investment, and from then on, you are creating a new revenue stream. The ARPU, so average return per user, has increased by $1.89 a month. So you can imagine when you have a 20 billion 
company, what, what does that mean? Right? So it's, it's a huge, huge number. That's a great number <laughs> and great prospects and a great collaboration and a contribution back to TM Forum so everybody can get the benefits of that. So where do you take it next? So taking it next, so obviously we have leveraged a lot of TM Forum assets and we also want to give back to TM Forum. So we want to go to a phase two of the catalyst. And in the phase two, we want to put generative AI on all layers of the interaction, not just the last mile. We are just scratching the surface of what's possible. So there are already about 200 messages came in of interested parties in our phase two catalyst. So hopefully we'll be back in June and you know we can blow the minds again. <laughs> this is tremendous and I'm hugely excited to see what's gonna happen next and the benefit that the CSB community can drive from this. That's it for now for Cloud Innovators Live in Telecommunications at Digital Transformation World.